What is up everybody? CJ Hawk85 here and today I'm gonna to be playing Sarah is Missing on a indie PC game. Thank you so much for watching my video. Like this video, subscribe today if you haven't. Follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook. Links are down below in the subscription box and I invite everybody to join the notification squad. Hit that bell button so that way you guys won't miss an upload. Alright, so this game, Sarah is Missing, is a horror game that I was told. So it's about a missing girl named Sarah who lost her cell phone. Lord knows where she's at. Um, she was supposed to go to some party with a friend. Unfortunately, we don't know what happened. So without any further delay, let's get this video underway, shall we? So this is Sarah's cell phone. And let's slide on lock. System failure. Your device ran into a problem and needs to reset. Do you want to restore your device into an earlier time? Might as well. System restore. IRIS. Okay. Welcome back, Sarah. This phone appears to be... You don't appear to be Sarah. Have we met? Oh boy. This doesn't look good. Who is Sarah? Sarah Young is the rightful owner of this phone. Of, of this phone, please return it to her. That's Sarah. Okay. I wish I could, but how? Based on your response, I assume she is not with you. I don't even know her. It's true. It seems that the last video she took implies that she is in danger. Would you like to watch it and help me verify? Uh, why not? Yeah, sure. Yeah, sure. Okay, so this is the video footage. I hear footsteps. <laughs> well, sounds like to me she's in danger. She's scared out of her mind. Because Lord knows what is out there. Probably kill a clown or whatever. How badly is the phone damage? Here's that only 14.3 of this device is operational. Okay. I think Sarah is in trouble. Yeah. Duh. Yes, it would appear to be so. I am this mobile's personal assistant. IRIS. It is my best interest to locate her and would be in your good assistance to help me find her. Why not? Why do you want me to help find Sarah? She is my owner. I want to make sure she is safe, is my prime directive. You sound human. Yes. I want. We are wasting precious time here. Will you help me find Sarah? Sure. I wonder what the uh, other response would be, no. I need to restore as much as the content in the phone as I able to. Please press the back button, then tap and hold anywhere on the home screen to proceed. Okie dokie. Let's do it. I believe I can recover some of the phone's data. Alright. Let's see. Would you like me to restore them now? Yeah. You got to. We're wasting precious time here. 
Remember, you can tap and hold at any part of the phone to ask me for help with anything. But if something out of capabilities, I will let you know. Message restored. Mail restored. Gallery restored. Music restored. Phone. Notes restored. Because I calculated only a minor. As I calculated, only a minor portion of this phone's content are available. Okay. Alright, let's take a look at the messages. Right, this chat is unavailable. You and I group. James. Coffee at... This is army time. Six o'clock? Yeah, sure, but let's make it 6.30. 6.30 it is. Bring the stuff I gave you yesterday. Next time, bring your own research, okay? What the hell are they talking about? Don't be like that. I got to go. Later, Dean. Joe. Ugh, he's so annoying. I'm so over him. Forget him, Sarah. You're on your own now. We have our ups and downs. It's normal. Why don't you do something fun, something crazy? I mean, you're doing it now, your endless research on this paranormal. Don't mess with paranormal! Why would you mess with that? I don't know, I guess you are right. You are the genius in our batch. Ugh, I'm so stupid. Yeah, you are, sometimes. But go easy on yourself. You're just getting used to it. It's one thing to break up and another to move on. Can you do me a favor? What? Meet someone new. Go meet a crazy friend. Try and dating try a dating app. You never know. I don't know. I don't know how to make friends. I already have one crazy friend. I don't think I can handle another. If I meet someone interesting, I usually just buy them a drink and take them home. Not too sure about this dating app. Really? Sometimes I can't tell if you are joking. Haha. <laughs> but put yourself out there. Go have a conversation with somebody at the cafe or something. A party might not be a bad idea. Have fun, please. Please? I don't know. Just try. Okay, fine, fine. I will. You'll be fine. Thanks, Jelly Beans. No problem. I'm here for you. If you need me, saving you has become my specialty. Haha, <laughs> very funny. You'll be alright. I know, I know. March 23rd, 2016. Hey, have a safe flight. Good luck and hope you save a lot of lives out there. Thanks, I'll be back sooner than you think. We'll miss you. Don't run into zombies and stuff. Even if you do, somehow I think you'll find a cure for it. Ha ha ha, I just might take care of you. Uh, nothing. Oh, Joe. Buddy. February 30th. So, how was your trip? It was terrible. Okay, why was it terrible? <sighs> Derek broke up with me. Sorry to hear that. By the way, free this weekend? No, I'm pretty busy. Got my final. All right. No, I'm pretty busy. Got my final bees to deliver. What is it about? Do you really want to know, buddy? Yeah, sure. I'm doing a research on the relatively on close to culture and how it transcends from verbal tales handed down through the generations to a digital and cyberspace hauntings. Okay, so Buddy changes the uh, subject. By the way, are you into butt stuff? I gotta go, Buddy. And no, even if I am, you're not in. No problem. Poke you later. March 30th, 2016. Nice weather today. 
could be better when it doesn't feel as nice as it was yesterday. Can I send you with some picks? I don't think so, buddy. I bet you'll like them. No, I don't think so. It's of my penis. Yes, I figured. It's big. I don't really care. Would you like to see it? No. Would you like to sit on it? Nope. Can I see you? Not at the moment. Can I see yours? I don't have a penis, buddy. <laughs> oh, man. I met your tits. I bet you have nice tits. I do, actually. Can I see them? Nope. Then over for me. No, thank you. No, thanks. Sorry, I'm just bored. I know, buddy. Go watch porn. Internet here is slow. Not my problem. Well, have fun there. Thanks, buddy. I don't know why I'm friends with you, really. Lucky me, huh? Squirt, 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 I guess. What a perv. Hitting on, uh, Sarah. Hey, do you like tapes and CDs? Yeah, it's been a while since I had them, though. Good, because I'm going to... Good, because I'm going to tape my penis on your head and you can see the nuts. Okay, buddy. That was actually funny. I wasn't really joking. And I'm out. Okay, so that conversation was random. Derek. So that was the boyfriend. Alright, so this was Valentine's Day. Hey, you there? What do you want? Nothing. I'm, I just... I'm about the board. Why should I care? Well, that's one of the probs, ain't... 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 Ugh. Well, that's one of the probs, ain't it? You barely care. Did you text me to tell me that? You're such an asshole. Look, I didn't mean it. Look, I didn't mean... I definitely didn't want to hurt you. I mean, I wish things were different. I don't want us to end, I guess. That's what I'm trying to say. I don't know. Urgh. I'm trying to tell you that this was not how I planned things to be. Things ended when you left. You left! You and your planning. Enough plans. You plan and plan and plan, but you never do anything. Sheesh. All you do is run and work and use your work as an excuse to avoid confronting the issue. I think you just described yourself. Why do you always do this? And you keep blaming my work for our problems. Stop blaming shit on me. And these na girls naked or not, they are not our problems. It's me and you, and you're the one that keeps avoiding this shit. Shifting problems here and there. Sheesh. How about, I don't feel like listening to your shit right now. Have you done enough? No, you don't listen. I'm trying to tell you. No, I don't want to listen. I'm tired of your lies and shit. Baby, listen, please. If you have nothing else to say, then stop texting me. I'm done with you. Done. Oh, this gets better. I can't believe that you decided to do this. Not that I'm effing celebrating it, but it's Valentine effing Times Day. Who the F leaves their girlfriend to fly back to another country to photographer to photographer new women. Jeez, really? On Valentine's Times Day, Jesus, and not have the balls to tell me about it. You lying piece of shit. Jeez. Not telling you something is not the same as mine. I told you, it's a last minute gig. It's a fashion shoot, babe. Let's get that straight. Man, oh man, oh man. You want to play technically with me now? Nothing <laughs> serious? Go away, Derek. Just go away. You're good at that. At least that's one of the <laughs> one damn thing you're good at. Just go. No thanks to you. I don't even effing know how to get back to our chalet. Our sorry, my mistake. It's my chalet now. I have to figure this out. Bye, Derek. Have a nice effing flight. Sarah, baby, I'm sorry. I'll make it up to you. You there? Hey, I'm boarding now. Take care. Sorry. Bye. That was a nasty breakup. March 3rd, 2016. Hey, how are you? Been a while. Hey, baby, talk to me, please. I'm so sorry. I miss you. 
April 13th, what are you up to? April 28th, Sarah, talk to me, please. April 30th, 2016, baby, I'm not your baby. Stop texting me. I need to move on. Okay, got it. Bye, Sarah. And that's when they officially broke up. Oh, by the way, I found out Sarah calls Derek, Derek asshole. Yes, he was. Try mom. Hi, mom. Just wanted to check in. Derek and I have decided to end things. Things were not working out, so... But I'm all okay. I'm sorry to hear that, Sarah, but I've always known that Derek could never keep up with you. Best you ended things before it got too serious. What time is your flight back? I can have my driver pick you up from the airport. Right. Well, Mom, actually, don't panic. I decided to say. Sir, I don't understand. You've just come out of a relationship and you're in a foreign land. Why would you want to stay? I need some time for myself, Mom. Being at home now, just, I can't. Okay. What do you mean? You get on this plane and come home. Mom, no, I can't. I canceled the flight tickets already. Anyways, why in the world would you do something so stupid as that, Sarah? Mom, listen. Sarah, you come home this instant. I will get my assistant to buy you a new ticket right now. Mom, no. I'm not coming home, and that's final. At least, not yet. I don't expect you to understand, but see you when I get back, okay? February 20th, 2016. Hi, Mom. Just to let you know, I've touched down walking to the immigration now. I thought you were supposed to arrive an hour ago. Really? Got delayed. Sorry, couldn't send you a text. I got to go into a meeting now. The driver is waiting for you. Okay, see you soon. We'll be back late. We'll talk to you when I come home. Okay. Okie dokie. The next day. Sarah, I've scheduled for you to meet with the Executive Creative Director of Lloyd Irving, the advertising agent, at noon tomorrow. Don't embarrass me. Right. One of those moms that wants what they want for their daughter. Mom, I have a semester to go to, and we've talked about this already. I'm not changing my major, and I'm certainly not going to be a copywriter. Mom, really, tomorrow's semester is pretty important for my grades. I can't skip it even if I want to. You're really going to pick up your silly research on ghosts of all things over possibly working in a top agency? I simply don't understand you fixations on ghosts, Sarah. I've let in go I've let it go for too long. I only want to help you build a promising career. Not throwing it all away just to be a ghost hunter. Mom, first of all, stop calling it ghost research or ghost anything. It's Parapsychology, and secondly, I don't want to be a copywriter like you. It's not just—it's just not what I want. And I hope you can understand that. Dad would understand. You know, the only reason why you can go on and do all your nonsense is because I allow it. I'm trying to make you—I'm trying to make sure you have a future, at the very least, a good paying job or a job that pays anything. How are you going to pay the bills with this kind of career path? The only reason you can do this is because you're living under my roof and I'm paying for all your expenses. You live a pretty comfortable life and spoiled one at that. I've given you nothing but the best and all I've asked for you is that you go for this one meeting and you shoot it down without even thinking about it. How ungrateful of you. And your father, he was good man, rest his soul, but useless at living. He was a bum. I wouldn't, I won't stand for it if you become like him. Wow, what a way to throw your, throw your frickin' husband to the curve. Couldn't even defend himself. Okay, Mom. 
going in for a meeting. I'll be home early today. You will have dinner at home. We will talk further on this. Okay. Mm. And that was it. Um. Hey, uh. Mm. Hey, Bootylicious. You okay? Feeling like the dumps? Come join me in some ABS at the club. This is April 27th, 2016, by the way. Sorry, babe. Got an assignment. Can't do it. Skip it, babes. They have abs like. All right. Skip it, babes. They have abs like, like, like abs like Tarzan. With a 64 pack on Tarzan. Sorry. You know I won't want to miss hanging out with you guys, but some other time. It's ladies night. It's ladies night. And besides, we got ice cream. You need a break. Come on, Mama. You know how them ice cream melts down abs. Okay. Tempting. Let's do this again. Tempting. But I'm going to pass besides I haven't gone clubbing in years. I don't really like ice cream, but hmm, chocolate lava brownies does sound so good. Celebrating freedom? You need a night out with me to forget all your troubles. I won't force you though I'll have one of your behalves. Thanks, I will catch up with you some other time and don't overdo it. Watch your calories. Ha ha ha. Betcha, yach. Betcha, betcha. You know they love to. Right, let's repeat that again. <laughs> let's repeat it again. Ha 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 ha. Betcha, betcha. You know they love my love handles. Them puppies, wow, mama. May 1st, 2016. Hey, where have you been? Why didn't you reply to me? I texted you last night. I have... I heard you went out with Faith last night, bitch. Why didn't you call me? I'm always the last... Last, uh... Oh, no. What the F? Let's get coffee. I got news. I met someone last night at the club. Man, those dip -less. Sarah, you there? I tried to call you, but I can't get... Through. Call me, Kay. Hey, Sarah, I'm worried you're being MIA, missing an action. You're not normally like this. No, she's not. Alright. Sarah's actions is unusual. How do you know what is unusual? Through various calculations of Sarah's regular activities and choices that she makes in her I can simulate in this directions. Okay, I can simulate and deduce that her actions or inactions in situations does not match her past behaviors. What is Sarah usually what is Sarah like usually? Her recent behavior shows that she is suffering for a run Possibly due to her relationship issues. But I'm no doctor. I agree with you. <coughs> Thank you. Anybody say God bless you. Alright. Let's take a look at Faith. April 28th, 2016. What are you up to this weekend? Swamp with my work, actually. Why? I need a favor. You always need a favor. What's new? Hey, don't be mean. I really want to go to this gathering. You mean a party? <laughs> yeah. I'm not really up for it. But it's sort of your thing, too. What do you mean? It's not looking good. It's wall... I don't even know what that means. Isn't that the witch's feast? How is that my thing? You're the pagan. Hey, I followed you to church, alright? What's the big deal? Anyways, you're like into all these supernatural stuff too. I'm not. No, no, no. Yeah, but I don't party with ghosts. I'm not going to fall for one of your common negations again, Faith. Aw, uh, that was a joke. Come on. Plus, there aren't real witches. I bet I'm the only real one around here. Just some guys playing Calvin. We all do. We all do it, you know. Halloween, hello. 
I don't know, Faith. Maybe not. Ask me again tomorrow or something. Just some guys playing Coven? Doesn't sound like it to me. I don't trust it, whether they play it or not. What is it? I don't even know what that means. Night in English. It's one of the Dutch and German's name for the night of April 30th. So called because it's the eve of the feast day in Nicaea. It is believed that the night of the witches meeting. Oh shit. Yeah, why would Sarah be involved in this? Based on the text history, it appears that Faith is a practicing Wiccan. What does Sarah believe? Sarah a Wiccan too? Sarah believes in finding the truth. I think there might be more clues. Let's go check the messages. I believe the gallery is corrupted. Would you kindly tap and hold the gallery icon? Alright. Oh, failed. Well, unfortunately, this app has stopped working. Please contact the developer for more information. Okay. There we go. Please wait while I find what's wrong. It seems Sarah has kept the lock. You will need the passcode to proceed further. The hint is Sarah's birthday. Can you just tell me? Is it possible for me to unlock this? I'm afraid I can't reveal personal information. You will, you will need to find that out yourself. Where should I start looking for her birthday? How the hell do I... I guess I'll just be kind of Perhaps it's somewhere in this device. Hint, happy birthday. How am I supposed to... Is it in mail? Let's see. Oh, here we go. Party mm -hmm. invite. No. Mm -hmm. Oh, here we go. There we go. You have successfully unlocked Sarah's gallery. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, I guess that is the end of part one, and stay tuned for, stay tuned for part two. Uh, like this video, subscribe today if you haven't, follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, links are down below in the subscription box, and I am CJHawk85, and I'll see you guys on part 2, because it's going to get creepy. See you later, bye.